Hi, my name is Arwan Srivastava. My film title is Parallel Lives and I was part of the Real Voices class of 2023. I heard about Real Voices through the Youth Day Festival that Sadaf ran. Um, my school went to go to the festival one of the days and um, I saw a bunch of people in my age range who were doing documentaries and were really creative. I thought it was really cool to see how people in my age were in this big movie theater, which I usually just associate with like independent projects or like these big blockbuster movies. We saw a lot of different diverse talents in the youth day because I went with my school. Uh, like there was kind of a shared experience between the people that made the films and the, um, our school. I really liked the community that we made in Real Voices. Uh, everyone was super supportive of each other and they were, everyone was really willing and open to speak their mind and share different viewpoints about what they thought um, about different issues and give like constructive criticism and also be like really nice to one another because we were all really open to the learning experience. We delved into a lot of like social issues and I think kind of grappling with that made the art itself that we were trying to make more like punctuated in terms of what we were talking about. Just hearing from all these different diverse voices in general was um, pretty gratifying because it made me feel more connected to everyone around me. It was awkward initially, but I think once we went to Balboa Park and once we started doing more classes together and being more open with each other, I think we found a lot of shared commonality between us in terms of similarities in the things that we like to do or things that we like to say. Um, and I think I also found a lot of like connection with their experiences and their backgrounds, seeing that our cultures were different, um, but also finding this level of connection between people. My film initially was gonna be more um, centrally focused on my own family and the different experiences that I've faced. And while I think that plays a major role in why I did it and that translates into my final product, I think seeing the different experiences that people in Real Voices had, it kind of pushed me to go out of my comfort zone and look for different um, other stories and see these kind of similarities between them so I could make a more fleshed out narrative as a whole. It was daunting at first because I haven't really done one of these festivals before, but um, I think the people around me made it seem a lot more comfortable. Seeing the amount of people that came to Sadaf and also the reception as a whole made me realize the scale of everything, but um, also that everyone is just super supportive of each other and really willing to put their hearts out for their work. I'm writing a couple stories. I don't know, I hope they're not like too ambitious for what I'm able to capably do. Some of them have themes that I was brought up in the documentary because I thought that they're really interesting and wanted to expand on them more. Um, a lot of them are about the immigrant experience. Um, because I can personally relate to that and I know a lot of people in the U.S. can. Keeping it in a presentable way where it's like you can use writing and storytelling to show different stories like that is really important for future generations and changing people's minds on issues that revolve around that topic. I feel one more confident to pursue doing movies and doing film festivals because of Sadaf and the environment that was around it and feeling really comfortable with the people that I was around but also I learned a lot about different people and how they respond to issues that I face similarly so I think using that would give me a lot more depth in my writing also just give me a more like profound sense of community between people where I can level on level with them a lot better. Be yourself, try and open up to the people around you. Um, be willing to share your story and know that there are people like your um, teachers and um, the students around you are probably going through the same thing where they're worried and awkward and just like <laughs> stressed about doing it in general. But it's worth opening up because I think you realize that you might have a lot more in common with them and you might find something that you didn't know about yourself or about the world in general. Uh, support the Pack Arts Movement.